What's good, it's YouTube? It's your boy Greg. Go crazy, go crazy. We are back here with another video. Now, before you do anything, go to press that like button for your boy. Go to press the subscribe button if you are new to my channel. As of right now, we have 109 subs. If y'all, one of y'all see this video and y'all ain't subscribed, you know, help your boy get to 110 real quick. And turn on the post notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a new video. Now, as you can see by the title and the thumbnail, this is a seven foot two way stretch big. Now, I made them seven foot because, you know, I've been playing the game for a few days. And, I mean, you can use a big for the wreck if you want to, but you don't have to. Most people I've played against, I mean, they've been horsing. But that's because I'm a low overall and I really got all my badges. Now, the people I've been playing, been some sweaters. I mean, them boys ain't left the room all weekend. They got Dorito crumbs all on a beard if they got a beard. They got a beer belly and everything. Like, why are we facing 96 overalls and on day three and four? Goat level, how, bro? What are you doing? Goat level already in day three or four is crazy. But I'm just saying, so if you want to send a bill that can shoot, this is the bill for you. Now, you can get posts on this bill. You can get driving done. You see the shooting, you get 20 shooting. I didn't really upgrade the playmaking like that because, I mean, you were sitting here you don't really need playmaking that much. You kind of do, but not really that much of this bill. This bill not really is a passer bill. This bill just like you to cook up, I mean, if you want to. Now, you see, you get 23 defensive. Now, you see, I was tweaking the stats a little bit, you know, making some things better, some things worse. You know, it all depends on you and your preference and your play style. If you want to make a shooting center, hey, this might be the build for you. It might be better versions of this build, but this is what is my version of the build, and this is what I would put on the build. Now, I always put free throws on my build at 70 max because you don't really need more than a 70 free throw on a center build. Now, you see some stats I don't really like. Now, you do get a lot of good finishing dunks. As you can see right now, I have 21 finishing badges. Now, this build can do really everything except for really playmate. Like I said, if you want to make a different version of the build, hey, it's on you. I mean, I ain't really upgraded that much because, I mean, I could, but I don't really care about it. How I should change some things around. But you see, this build does get finishing, shooting, and defense. Now, what I've played the game, and from my experience, most people are going to try to get anchor. You really probably need anchor. Like, I'm not even going to lie. If you can get anchor, try to get anchor on Hall of Fame because as of right now, in the current state of the game, people are rim running a lot because they know they can get it all. Because a lot of people really don't have that badge. You can get blocks all. But if you don't have that badge or you're rating up, they're going to finish at the rim over you as of right now. Trust me, I know. But right now, as you can see, the badge count is big. I'm still tweaking stuff. It go for a very from 19 to 20 on the finishing right now. But the shooting is going to stay 20. That's not really getting touched at all. You can put a little bit more on your free throw. It really don't matter. You see, I got my defensive rebounding up because I like rebounding on my players. Some people sacrifice on their bills. I really don't. Now, I'm telling you, man, I got some crazy bills coming out. But as you can see right now, it really depends on the takeover you want me. Since it's a two-way stretch, big build, I put on limitless. If you a shooter, you put on limitless. Hey, I'm pulling this shit. I'm putting on limitless. And I put on paint intimidation. Now, as you can see, the title for this build is called a rim protector. Now, I don't know why they compare me to people that don't. Valachunas, he kind of shoots, but not really that much. Jared, Jared Jack, I mean, Jared Allen doesn't shoot at all. Jared Allen is not a three-point shooter. I don't know why they call this build a rim protector. I guess because like, I got a lot of defense on this build. But I'm telling you, man, if you want to make a shooting center, this is one of the one of the nice builds on finishing. Now, he gets a lot of finishing badges. Now, you see, I put on silver drop separate. I get bronze post riser on this build. And it's, I mean, it's crazy how, like, you can really upgrade, like, only so much on this game. I like it, though. I like it. Everybody can be a demigod. Now, I do see some people out there making some crazy builds. Like, everybody right now is making that 6, 8, 
bill. I'm gonna drop my version of those bills real soon, so stay tuned for that. Now for my um core badge, I did pick Bully. I seen the clip of Bully on Twitter, and oh my goodness, Bully is a crazy badge. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Bully is a crazy badge. Like he literally threw Buddy like off a cradle, off a cradle up. He threw the dude off of a cradle layup. Bully is going to be a crazy badge. If you are not strong, bro, you are getting cooked. Bully is that badge. I'm not even going to lie to you. If I make a play, I might try to put Bully on him. That's a guard. I have to see, though. You know, I got to really get on the sticks and really, you know, make the build. I want to make my version of it. Now, as you can see, I'm going to the shooting badges now. The shooting badges are kind of, okay, I didn't really get to test all the shooting badges yet. I did kind of test Mini Magician. Mini Magician is kind of good. You do need blinders and shit if you want to shoot. Like, if, if you want, if people shoot on the side of you, you probably do want to use blinders. Because if they're on the side of you, last year they was on the side of you, you really did need the badge. Because they wasn't going to get a good closeout contest on you. But this year... If you're a big, you're probably going to need blinders. You probably won't need blinders in general. I'm not even going to lie to you. Because it was a few shots in the wreck. I was wide open. But dude was on the side of me. I got a 30% contest. And he wasn't even really near me. And they called it a 30% contest like I said. So blinders, hey, they retweaked that badge. So you are going to probably need it. Now as you can see, I put for my core badge for shooting. I put catch and shoot on silver. Now you see, I wanna, I wanna really test down chest on artists. All right, no chest on artists is gonna be cold when I really match my bills out. Now gold brick wall, brick wall is gonna be good. I seen a clip on Twitter again of somebody with Hall of Fame brick wall. He laid Buddy out. It was crazy. I ain't even gonna lie. That screen he set on Buddy was crazy. He flew like I ain't never seen nobody fly off the screen. Last time I seen somebody fly off the screen like that was probably like 2K20. That's when they had that um. Takeover badge in the park. I think it was like Iron Wall or something. I don't know what it was. But anyway, yeah, but you see, I'm out here, I'm reworking the badges, you know, trying to see what I can get. I'm trying to put more of my tier three badges because you do need anchor. Anchor is useful every time. If you don't have anchor, I feel bad for you. You're going to need it. If you're a center or a big, you're going to need anchor. You can have all these badges, but if you don't have anchor, they're going to dunk on you. I promise you. You can jump with them. Do whatever you want. But you're going to be anchor. But yeah, man. That's really it for this video, man. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. If you're new, this is me, your boy Greg. Go crazy and I'm out.